faith, true faith in Jesus is a good thing, a very good thing. And so in faith, you step out to use your gifts and abilities that God's given you with all the best intentions in the world. <laughs> good for you. Hi, I'm Bernie Diamond and welcome again to Fresh. It's awesome to have a true faith in God, one that remains steadfast through thick and thin. And as we saw yesterday, that small flame of faith becomes a raging fire as we exercise our God-given gifts and abilities for His glory. That's exactly what God's Word says. I remember your true faith. That kind of faith first belonged to your grandmother Lois and to your mother Eunice. I know you now have that same faith. That's why I want you to remember the gift God gave you. God gave you that gift when I laid my hands on you. Now, I want you to use that gift and let it grow more and more like a small flame grows into a fire. But without doubt, the moment you step out in faith to use those gifts, to bless others with them, to bring glory to Jesus' name, you're going to run into opposition, spiritual opposition and worldly opposition. It happens every time, which is why in the very next breath, Paul writes this, the spirit God gave us doesn't make us afraid. His spirit is a source of power and love and self-control. Just let that sink in. When Satan unleashes all the powers of hell against you, God's spirit is your source of power, of love and of self-control. Don't be afraid. That's God's word, fresh for you today. And as you allow the Holy Spirit to breathe His Word into your heart, that power, love and self-control will grow. That's why I'd love to send you your fresh devotional every day, a powerful scripture verse together with some words of inspiration, hope and encouragement to help you be all that God made you to be. It's completely free. Just stop by at freshdevotional.org for instant access. That web address again is freshdevotional.org. 